Hello everyone, blessed to be here with my week 20 weigh-in. And yes, I did not go to my weigh-in last week. And that was the weekend after Thanksgiving and for obvious reasons. <laughs> um, you guys, I just didn't want to put myself I didn't want to like, it felt like I would be setting myself up to go to a meeting. And yes, going to a meeting may have helped me, but I just was in denial. I did not want to step on a scale after, you know, a big day of eating like Thanksgiving. So I just made the executive decision to not go to my weigh-in last week. And yes, I am so sorry I didn't have a weigh-in to post, guys, but as it goes with the weight loss journey, if I lost that week, then it still would show this week. But to be honest, guys, I don't think I lost that week. Um, I am not going to lie. I did not step on the scale on Saturday. I did not step on the scale until Sunday. That's how upset I was about the whole Thanksgiving eating and then the day after Thanksgiving eating. And I just, I'm so glad Thanksgiving is over. The message is great, but the food and all that food coming at me is just not great. So I'm so glad it's over. Okay, now let's go to this week <laughs> as far as this week goes guys you know how you have those weeks where you just you're like Lord I do not want to go to that meeting Lord I do not want to step on that scale please do I really have to go to that meeting well today guys <laughs> this week wasn't one of those weeks for me because I lost weight <laughs> I just have to be dramatic for you guys yes I lost weight guys I did it I mean if you guys watched my last video I was like you know something's got to give something's got to give because I have just been struggling a little bit and I've been you know lifting weights and exercising and going through sobriety and just feeling like I'm doing things right and not getting any results but not this week this week I got results <laughs> and I feel so good about it guys I feel really good so let's see uh, the last way in that I had not last week the week before Thanksgiving that week I was at 228 pounds well this week guys I wrote it down this week I'm at 224.4 pounds that means I lost a big whopping 3.6 Oh my gosh. And it's like, how much of that came off this week combined with last week? But to be honest, I don't think I lost any weight after Thanksgiving. So, oh my gosh, guys. I don't care when I lost it, but from my last weigh-in, I am down 3.6. It has been so long for me, guys, for a good weigh-in. Like, this is, is, it's been so long, and I'm so excited and so glad. And I just feel like, you know... Finally, that thing that's got to give, it finally gave, and I am I'm moving along on this weight loss journey. So, that takes me to a total loss of 8 point something pounds. Um, I'll, I'll put it somewhere up here. But yes, yeah, so I am down more than 8 pounds, and oh my gosh, guys, I'm so close to tasting 10 pounds down. And I know it seems like I've been on this journey forever since when did I start, like, sometime in July but oh my gosh guys this is this is what I'm talking about it's like I mean you could go up and down and up and down but just don't give up I did not give up I'm still standing I'm still here and I feel great and and this is this is great I mean imagine if I just quit like a couple of weeks ago or quit the other times where I was up on the scale I wouldn't have this joy that I have right now of being down guys and it just feels so good I just feel like Finally, finally, something's happening in this weight loss journey, okay? <laughs> so, with that being said, since I weigh less, uh, the leader told me that I lost one smart point. So now, instead of getting 36 smart points for the, for the day, I get 35 smart points. I don't think I'm going to miss that smart point. I may or may not. We'll see how it goes as far as food uh, throughout the week. And let's see. So, what did I do to lose this weight this week? Well, guys... I think I pinpointed it. See, this is why I'm so happy too. I think finally, and I don't remember whose video I was watching, but like, well, not just hers, but a bunch of other people. People are like, you just, with this whole weight loss thing, you have to see what, you know, what's going to work for you. You have to figure out what's, you know, your kind of sweet spot, what spot or what methods are going to be, you know, specific to you. And I think I found mine. And this is what I did this week, guys. This week, I barely touched my weeklies. And since I'm doing Vlogmas now, 
I um I'm gonna be posting all of the things that I eat. So I think I posted two videos. If you look how many weeklies I have had left, I only I was left with like 31 weeklies, so I only used like um, 11 weeklies. And of course, uh, I exercise too. I didn't make it every day, but I exercise. So, I mean, I already like worked off those 11 weeklies that I used. So I think my sweet spot for this weight loss journey, or ugh, I'm like foaming at the mouth. <laughs> my sweet spot is to just not use the weeklies. I mean, it's working out. I mean, that's what I did this week. I've done that in the past, but I think right now my body's adjusting and I think this is good. I mean, guys, I'm I was down 3.6 today and Tom is here right now. And I mean, I'm just stoked. I mean, oh my gosh, I can't wait. I hope next week when Tom's gone, I'm just even lower on the scale. <laughs> So my sweet spot I think I found is to not use the weeklies. And when I first did this weight loss journey with Weight Watchers a long time ago, I never used to use the weeklies. So I guess, you know, different strokes for different folks and that's, I think, what's going to work for me. Okay, so um, I'm still doing the sober thing. And announcement, I made it to 30 days of sobriety. Actually, it's a few over 30 days, but let's just take the 30. And I'm going for 30 more. And then we'll see how things go after that. But I'm excited, guys. I don't know what else to say. And yes, like I said, Vlogmas, I'm participating in it. But as much as I can commit to is doing what I ate videos every day. And that's still a step up for me because usually I only post like two to three videos. But I'm going to commit to posting what I ate videos just so you guys can, you know, see what I eat every day. And, and actually, I think I should just continue doing that because... You know what? It's good for accountability and it's good to just, you know, get feedback from you guys and, you know, if I, I struggle, maybe you guys can help pinpoint what's going on in my diet, things like that. So, oh my gosh, guys, all I want to say is I am so excited and um, thank you guys for watching these videos. Thank you for, uh, for all the people that watch me who have been there since when I started, who are new viewers to me now. Thanks guys for being on this journey with me and I just can't wait. I'm excited and I'm ready to see what's going to happen. So I'm ready for the new week and let's do this weight loss thing. All right. Talk to you guys later. Bye.